Hello there, folks. My name is Jay Loman. Now, before I let you know about what recently happened to me, let me tell you a little bit about myself. I'm really one of those people who can say that I had a great childhood. When I was 16, I decided that after I graduated from high school, I was going to go to film school to become a filmmaker. At my graduation, I told everyone I was going to go to film school, but just a few days after that, that's when things started going downhill. I received a letter from the film school I applied to in the mail saying that they had received my final transcript and were not pleased with what they saw. For seven months I felt as if I made a mistake, but when Christmas came along, things began to turn around. I got a brand new video camera for Christmas last year. After that I got me a part-time job, saved up some money, and decided that I would go on the road to try and find a subject for a documentary. I thought it was going to be easy. Turned out it wasn't. Well, this is definitely not easy. I thought it was going to be easy, but it isn't. I just checked out of another hotel. That's about like, uh, it's uh, about 15. Let's just, uh, get some breakfast and uh, go find a place to spend the night. I only had $350 in my pocket. When I found the spot on Dagger Road, I felt as if it was my lucky day. Okay, uh, I think we're pretty lucky to find this little spot right here. Because I definitely did not want to spend the night in another hotel. Look at this place around here. Total Gullsville if I've ever seen it. Don't worry, nothing's gonna happen here. All we gotta do, all we gotta do here is sleep here during the night, wake up, go to the nearest gas station, gas up, get us a few drinks, a few chips, and we'll be back on the road again. But I still have a, a huge box full of tapes that haven't been opened yet. And I'd hate to go home with them without ever finding a subject. But it's either this or just another night at some cheap hotel. No swimming pool, no hot tub, no girls in the bikinis, no nothing. Okay, uh, just recently while we were uh, looking for this spot, as you might uh, see in here, ow, ow, take a look at this. I want people to uh, know this, because uh, while we were uh, on our way here, you accidentally hit a curve and uh, spilt my drink all over the seat. It's a good thing we found that, uh, that pawn shop. And I could have used that money to buy more videotapes. So, uh, go ahead and uh, turn the camera off, Al, and uh, we'll just go ahead and uh, listen to the radio while we're here. And then gas up in the morning. I thought it was a good place to spend the night. It's what happened that night that surprised me.